I have a background in IT and I would not have gotten this far without this course. Whatever you're learning right now, all the tools that you're learning, make sure that you get a good understanding on how to use them because you will need them at the end of it all. When you get to the capstone, you want to remember how to use these tools. What do they do? Remember, try to remember some basic commands and then you'll be good. Our company conducted a penetration test on B-Bank's website to identify vulnerabilities in their security defenses. Here is a summary of the findings. So when we ran our scanning tools on the site, we found six, uh, 56 unique vulnerabilities. Four of them are critical. Four can be easily exploitable and that is bad. Um, a summary of those vulnerabilities found was a SQL injection, cross-site scripting, weak password policy, and unprotected database. Some recommendations for securing B-Bank. Conduct a comprehensive security assessment. B-Bank should thoroughly assess its website and database systems to identify vulnerabilities and, and potential attack vectors. Implement strong access control measures. Strong access control measures, including complex passwords, two-factor two authentications, and updating access privileges should be Im implemented. Regularly update software and systems. All systems should be kept up to date with the latest security patches and, and updates to, to minimize the risk of known vulnerabilities being exploited. Train employees on cybersecurity's best practices. Regular training should be provided on best practices, including identifying and reporting potential security incidents. We had to dig deep to some of the stuff that we kind of forgot about. And we yeah. had to go back through like yeah. old modules and go back to the CompTIA lab, Comptia like the insertion we, lab. Just try mm -hmm. to, you know, get us back into the mindset of like, okay, what tools do we need to use? And how do we follow the pen test process to really crack into this website? I think I spent more time looking at looking at old lessons. Yeah, that is. <laughs> and just rereading everything to try to figure this out. I just helped them with one of the tools that they could use and they were uh, doing some attacks and they were uh, finding all the vulnerabilities and they were able to get to this point. Thank you so much to Renier, Jonathan, our amazing instructor, Robert. He did a fantastic job and the entire Cyber Warrior team, Alvis, Isaac, everybody who helped us out along the way. Appreciate you. Our goal is to perform a gray box vulnerability scan of B-Bank customer portal. We then use this information to potentially gain access to a system to exploit various vulnerabilities that we come across. Afterwards, we'll provide our findings and recommendations to strengthen and remediate any potential security flaws. Accessing the database. So since we already had the root access, we were able to use SSH and use a port forwarding method. This allowed us to gain access to the MySQL database and allow us to query the databases. As you can see here on our right, we have show databases and we can see many databases that we can access. And if we bring that down a bit further, running the query show tables, we can see multiple tables listed here, including users, which is very interesting as when we queried for that, select from users, we were able to see the emails, username and passwords, including the admin, which allowed us to gain entry to the B-Bank website. So here we went over some of the top two uh, concerns we found with the OWASP, and we also um, highlighted a potential uh, phishing and spear phishing um, vulnerability as well. Uh, to start off with the snapshot that we have, we have the top 10 web application security risks so in closing, uh, B-Bank must ensure an ongoing plan for monitoring triage and applying updates and configuration changes for the lifetime of the application. This also means proper and consistent training for all employees, as well as proper review with clients on how to keep their account confidential to prevent possible data breaches. And remember, whether it's in the sun or in your network, you can always rely on the copper tones. Thank you. I mean, I can personally say that the six months was pretty intense and that um, if it hadn't been, you know, for the support that from my TAs and my teachers that, you know, it, there were definitely some personal things going on in my life that that support really kind of helped me get through it. So that that was definitely um, appreciated because, yeah, there was a lot Absolutely. going on. So. A big yeah. shout out to the TAs and and our, our teacher. It was, you know, without them, we, we wouldn't have been able to be here.
Um, and, you know, there's a lot to be said about showing up to class and there are things that happen in your life that you have to miss class, but there's also the, every class is recorded so you can always go back and, and look at it. But your teachers are always going to be there and I can say without a doubt, you know, having with Isaac and Albus and Rob, they're always there. They're always reaching out to see yep. if you're okay. If you haven't missed a class, they'll see where are you. It's a, you know, it's a massive help to keep you engaged and, and you know, keep yourself going in the program because you are learning a ton. You're, you're exposed to so many different tools that at one point you're like, oh wait, did we use that tool? So you really have to, you know, take your time with the program, really, you know, go through each lesson and know that, you know, at the end of it, it's all gonna make sense. And mm -hmm. I think it's a big deal for this course too. It's kind of a teach you how to fish in a way. You're getting hands-on training, but you're also being exposed to all these great applications. And, you know, whether it's two days from now or six months from when you're in a new job, you're like, oh wait, I remember that tool. I have an idea of how to run a, a scan and, you know, how to, you know, port forward or things of that nature. So I think it's an amazing, it was an amazing time. and with our uh, classmates and teachers.